evening, parents and guardians of students with disabilities. As you all know, following the executive order by Washington State Governor Jay Inslee, the Moses Lake School District, as well as schools across our state, have been closed. These closures remain in effect through April 24th. We continue our work with the governor, OSPI, superintendents and leaders from across the state, as well as our health district and local school administrators to do what is best for our students, staff, family, and community members. At this time, reducing the spread of COVID-19 is our primary concern. We understand that extended school closures create hardships among numerous families in our district, and our community relies on resources provided from the school. Weeks without conventional structure and care may seem overwhelming, both emotionally and financially. Please know that we're doing our very best to make decisions that take care of all of us during this difficult time. We recognize our need to consider our students with disabilities on a case-by-case -case basis to address their health and safety needs. Our district is providing educational opportunities for all students during this closure, and we planned to include provisions for our special education students and related services as part of that plan. These plans assist us in ensuring students with or without disabilities have equitable access to learning. While we expect to receive more details and further guidance in the days to come, here's what we know at this time. First, we will continue to con communicate updated information as we know it. We're making every attempt to honor existing IEP and evaluation meeting dates. We currently have various options to communicate through a remote delivery to hold meetings virtually. However, IEP teams are not required to meet in person while schools are closed. Even though the district is taking active steps to provide special education services, they will look very different during this time in digital delivery. If you have questions, our district has set up a remote learning hub site on our website at www.mlsd161.org where you can post questions and get additional resources to assist. This closure requires a tremendous amount of hard work, dedication, and creativity from our entire staff, and we are grateful for your patience and understanding as we attempt to navigate this very difficult situation. We will be sending frequent updates with information and resources via email, text message, website, and social media channels. We thank you for your patience as we progress together through this uncharted territory. Have a great weekend. Thank you.